I am really slacking this morning. Oh my gosh. Good morning, guys. Welcome to the vlog. Um, we haven't done this in a while. Let's do the scary car of the day after the intro. We've never done this before. It's now time for the scary car of the day. So can anybody post down in the comments what the problem is with this car? 2005 Nissan Titan. That's one brake pad. That's another brake pad. Hmm, a little bit of a discrepancy there. There's another brake pad and holy crap, what happened to this one? I didn't get it on the vehicle. I'm sorry, I didn't get the scary car of the day on the vehicle, but as you can see, there is freaking nothing, no friction material left on this pad. It is metal to metal and honestly, it was just about ready to slip through and like get flung out. <laughs> So scary. It is a B E A beautiful day. Seriously. I mean, look at the weather. I was expecting it to start turning all nasty this time of the year that we've had like our threats of it turning all nasty. And then we get this. This is just fantastic. Oh, so awesome. Anyway, guys, had to get out of the house. Uh, when I get back, I got to get into like work mode again and I got to pull a transmission. Now that's scary. This will be my first transmission job on my own. I hate it when I do this. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. Obviously I had a squirrel when I was writing it down or somebody changed your mind or something. I have no idea what happens at 1 p.m. What the frick happens at 1 p.m.? Now I'm scared, especially since it's 1.20. Am I supposed to be somewhere? One hour later. And yes, just a little while later, I find out where I was supposed to be at one o'clock. <laughs> Jason Christopher 77. Sorry, bro. Um, yeah, he had said, uh, long story. This is the night that I had all the my social media meltdown and that's him vlog bombing. So I'm screwing with the vlog time continuum right now, Chris. Yeah, that's the night that I had the, the social media like, oh my God, Calgon, take me away. And it kind of tripped out. So yeah. Man, I need a bookkeeper. I need a scheduler. I need a bigger company. I need a shop. I need, I need more moss. All right, I guess that means that it's lunchtime. I gotta get something in my belly and, oh shoot, copyright. But here we go. Here is the spooky town village during the day. Ooh, not so spooky during the day, eh? That's just so cool though. I like it. Every time I come in, I see Halloween now. That's the way it should be. Wow, <laughs> I don't realize how dirty I am until I, I was doing some Snapchatting and I saw like how dirty I am and it's just like pretty freaking disgusting and ridiculous. Anyway, I think, fingers crossed, that I'm just about ready to uh, pull this transmission. So, <laughs> uh, this, this right here, this is my view, well, without the camera strap in the way. This is my view of this transmission, hoping to God this thing doesn't fall down on my face. Um, yeah. Again, this is another scary car of the day. This is scary stuff, guys. I hope that it doesn't weigh too much. I want to try and like, I want to try and muscle it out. <laughs> I'm scared. I wanted to start this clip out by saying, here goes nothing, and then I got to thinking about it. It's like... That's a really weird expression, here goes nothing. It's like people have no confidence in their own ability. Here goes nothing, no, no, no. Here goes something, I just don't know what that something is. Oh my gosh, I got it out. I cannot believe it, hold on, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, gotta, I gotta get to the place, I gotta get to the place, I gotta get to the place, I gotta get to the, how many times can I say that? I gotta get to the place and I gotta drop the transmission off. Oh my gosh, I got it done, early. Woohoo, I'm done working, and it's only seven o'clock. <laughs> It was a good day, um, but yeah, I'm done working. Well, except I do have to make a, a text real quick. I almost said make a phone call, but texting is so much easier. So much easier to text. What a day! I don't know what to do now. I want to go home and rest. I want to go home and sleep. I want to get. I want to go right now because it's a green light. Come off thought of the day. Sometimes you're the windshield. Sometimes you're the bug. Well, I don't know if it's going to pan out or not, but. Um... Juan and I are planning on uh, going out tonight somewhere, I don't know, nightclub, something like that. Oh, it's quiet outside. Here I am <laughs> with the freaking brat. Garlic. <laughs> Probably not the best choice, but I'm hungry. 
And before Ram gets a chance to say, I got you other brats, I wanted a garlic one, all right? Because they're good and I like them. Garlic rules. I don't know what it is about garlic. I'm certainly not a vampire. Although I'd really like to be a vampire without the sparkles. No sparkles on vampires. All right, well, that didn't work out for tonight. Um, so I came in here and I did like today's administrative stuff. Pretty much all of it for the business. I know, really exciting stuff, huh? But I think what I want to do now is uh, I think I want to go and I'm going to sit my butt down, relax for a second because it's good to do because there's more in, more to life than just working. I'm going to turn off the radio so I don't get a copyright strike because you guys don't know this song anyway because I was talking so much. And I want to sit down and watch Ice Road Truckers. Yep. Spooky town. Ladies and ghouls, it is time for commenting on comments. Cock for short. <laughs> Depends on how you look at it, literally. All right, so I ended up watching Ice Road Truckers and then I watched, oh my gosh, I watched a bunch of other things and I just kind of vegged out for a while. So yeah, so I got to looking at it and it's like, there's nothing Halloween related in the vlog today, except for this, right? Now it's a Halloween vlog, because I did this, and we have the scary car of the day, and this. You guys are so incredibly awesome. There are 31 comments tonight, so obviously I can't get to all of them. Uh, thank you for responding and commenting, Riot Starter B, and Grim Reaper, and Angel in the Dark 5, and Ramthal, and Ramthal said that um, as far as dust and spooky town, canned air helps with dusting. It doesn't remove everything, but it can get some of it off of it. Um, yes, I, I do recommend doing that outside, <laughs> or else it just redistributes the dust everywhere. Grave Digger, you look at Poltergeist, you mean that we're going to be uh, viewing pol Poltergeist uh, before your birthday. So cool. The day before your birthday. That's awesome. Uh, Dabit353, very useless words. I'm glad that the booby trap has volume button. That would drive me nuts. Not even the squirrels would like me after that. Wackus85, the day ain't over till a man takes his pants off. And the barb girl said, I see London, I see France, I see Troy's underpants. That is so funny. Branson Haunted Hills and Triv27, I agree. That's what I'll say. And that barb girl, how did I miss Periscope last night? Sad panda. Sorry, I was going to do it tonight, um, but I vegged out, so I didn't. Oh my gosh! Okay, The Energized. Spooky Town is fabulous, just a suggestion, but would you consider placing a string of lights at the edge of the cabinet so the non-lit items can be seen better when the room light is off? Yes, and actually I talked to Triv27 about this when he gave them to me. The, uh, I almost said acorn. The candy corn lights. I was thinking about putting those around there. It, it I don't think it would, it, it, it would be a little cheese. But a little cheese sometimes is good. It's not too cheesy, just a little cheese. Also, thank you for commenting, Jason Christopher 77 and Triv27, and Tony Fredrickson, and no, you're not a stalker. Steve Lewis, Spooky Town, one word, freaking awesome. That's actually two words, but I'll let it slide this time. <laughs> Lacey O, were you watching The Nightmare Before Christmas? You're awesome. Actually, I was listening to the soundtrack, but we'll go with that. So the answer to the question that Muxlanabas Crypt asked the other night, he says that in, or Alfred, Alfred, <laughs> take two. Alfred Hitchcock was seen in Psycho twice. Once in the real estate office, he walked past the window before the money was stolen. And when Marion Crane, AKA Janet Lee, goes to sell her black Ford, you can clearly see his reflection in the door when she opens it. Nice. Adam S., um, how much was it? I don't know. I didn't buy it. And are you going to decor decorate outside your house for Halloween? Yes, of course. Whoa, Trucker Josh Vlogs! Awesome! Um, sometimes... <laughs> really, dude? <laughs> sometimes halfway through the day, I find myself half naked too. It happens. We need to talk because... I, I, I just hope that you don't have like one of those windows in the door of your truck, like down by your feet. Because that could be really kind of awkward. New commenter, I believe, Lisa Andrade Mason. So you said you're not going to take down Spooky Town. Don't! About five years, or four years ago, I don't know why I said five. Four years ago, I decided I was not going to take down all my Halloween decor, especially my witches, so I didn't. Now my kitchen and dining room are Halloween year-round. Life is too short, so enjoy what you love all the time. 
I agree. I totally agree. And that's why I leave like a lot of this. I mean, I, I, I leave like a lot of stuff up, which makes decorating in the fall <laughs> so much easier. And the last comment of the night, Jolson, what did mama tell you about girls? Girls are the devil, except your mama. The water boy, right? I, I, I like Vicky Mountain Court, and, and she let me feel her boobies, and, and that, 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 that's some high quality H2O. Well. Right? Okay. All right, guys. Happy hunting. See you tomorrow. Hello, I'm Lou Temple. You know me as Axel from The Walking Dead, and I say to you, happy haunting. You follow me?